Hello, this is Pox. Welcome to the Brew Review. Today, I'm going to be reviewing a very useful application for your iPhone. Actually, two useful applications for your iPhone. One is NetAtalk, and the other one is Categories. NetAtalk is a, kind of an open source implementation of Apple Talk. You install it on your iPhone, and then if you've got a Mac, uh, it'll give you full access to your iPhone's file directory so, over the wireless. So you can use it to install ROMs if you download like the NES emulator, or you can use it to pull off video if you're using Sitecorder, or if you want to just use it as a mass storage device and just throw files on there when you're going between your uh, computer at home and your computer at work. It works great. I'd say it's an absolute must if you're a Mac user. And the other application I was wanted to tell you about today, just to make things simpler to get around on your iPhone, is categories. Instead of scrolling through like seven or eight pages of apps, you can make a folder on your iPhone, choose which applications you want to go in it, and it just clears up a whole lot of mess. I take it back, I'm adding a third application. <laughs> Another must have is Backgrounder. And this, this is an awesome program. It doesn't have any interface really, what it does is it allows programs to run in the background. So if you have categories installed, you launch it, it takes a little bit to launch once, but you hold in the home button and it'll say background or enabled and it leaves the process running in the background. Now if you're using Safari, like on the old version of the iPhone firmware, um, like you could, you could go out of Safari and back into Safari and it wouldn't reload everything. Now that you have backgrounder, you can leave Safari running so you can pull up a, a page or two, hold in the home button, then leave into another program, then come back and all those pages are still there. It's, you got to be a little bit careful because it'll slow down, if, obviously, if you're running too many applications. But if you want to listen to uh, Pandora or Last.fm, Backgrounder is a must for any jailbroken iPhone. So there you have it. You've got three applications this go around. Um, I'm recommending that you get NetAtalk to install ROMs or to pull off videos and I'm uh, suggesting that you get categories to organize everything on your iPhone when you install all these different applications and I'm also recommending Backgrounder so you can run all these applications at the same time and crash your iPhone or at least slow down the keyboard but seriously though it's great if you want to listen to net radio and do other things or like I said if you want to pull up things in Safari and come back to them later without having to wait for it to reload. This is Pox. Thank you for watching the Brew Review. We'll see you next time. Uh, you can follow me on Twitter at Walking Crow. You can subscribe to our feed on YouTube or on our website at twosmartguys.com. Uh, we have forms on there so if you've got immediate questions and I, I can't get to you right away if you try and email me, the forms are an excellent place. There's literally hundreds if not thousands of people on there that'll help you out 24 seven just cause they're, they're great people. <laughs> this has been a Two Smart Guys production.